I really appreciate you joining me today and this is a follow up to a story that I did about an hour ago and thank you to our reporter Dave Nathan for his coverage from the scene. He spends hours of his time to make sure that we get the best footage. This is about the Fulham Palace Road supermarkets that were the victim of a contamination and interfering with goods by a man who has been arrested and appeared in court already. He has been named as Leo Al Garib and he was accused of injecting food with blood as some witnesses have said at the scene. They say that he's from Crabtree Lane, Fulham, and appeared at Westminster Crown Court on Friday afternoon and did not enter any plea. He's a solicitor in the area. The defendant is said to have first entered the Waitrose store at 7.30 and started throwing around syringes filled with blood and injecting them into food items. The court heard he's accused of doing the same thing at a nearby Sainsbury's where he's also alleged to have thrown eggs. It is claimed that he went on to inject more items at Tesco Express before being arrested. The court was told that Al Garib was a solicitor and a man of previous good character and forensic tests are underway. Every single supermarket was shut down and determined the crime scene and Dave went to every single one of these scenes in order to show you what was going on and the process that he takes when it's happening. So it's a terrifying incident that has occurred and affects people in the local area so I think it's really important to make sure that we keep up to date with everything that happened. They say the items affected were processed meat and microwave meals and Hammersmith and Fulham Council advised shoppers to throw away any food that was bought in them stores on the 25th of August. Al Garib was remanded in custody and will appear at Oldsworth Crown Court on Saturday the 24th. So really appreciate you joining me for this update and I'm definitely going to follow this story and we'll let you know the outcome of this case as well. So anybody in that local area of Fulham, be sure to tell friends and family to be aware of anything they may have purchased at that time from them stores and don't forget you can get the latest updates as well on the website and also instagram facebook tiktok and twitter i'll be back again very shortly with some more news peace Thank <laughs> you.